Welcome to Forgotten Islam. Vaccination is without doubt the best way to fend off a disease. So what is a vaccine and how does a vaccine work? The vaccine is a weakened or inactive form of a certain disease that is injected into the infected person for their immune system to develop an antibody against the disease. In this time and age, to develop a vaccine takes 8 to 12 years and for some viruses or diseases, there is never a vaccine. To this day, vaccines are a cure to be grateful for all over the world. But who discovered this ingenious way of curing diseases? It was discovered by the Anatolian Muslim Turkic tribes under the Seljuk Caliphate who already knew about the methods of vaccination nearly 300 years ago. They called vaccination ashi or engrafting in English. The Turkish people had inherited this skill from their ancestors. They learned that if they inject their children with cowpox taken from the breasts of cattle, they wouldn't develop smallpox. However, their remarkable vaccination methods were unknown, especially in England, where the doctors struggled against these everlasting diseases, such as smallpox. It was the wife of the English ambassador of the Ottoman Caliphate, Lady Mary Montagu, who during 1716 to 1718 learnt about the Turkish vaccinations and got her son vaccinated by the embassy surgeon, Charles Maitland. She was fascinated to find out that there was a cure to diseases and whilst living in Istanbul, she sent letters to England in which she described the vaccination process in detail. Many of her relatives used these methods soon to find out that they work. Nevertheless, she found opposition in England against these new methods. It wasn't only from the English intellectuals and doctors, but even the churches started to object. Although there was opposition, soon after these methods became a great success in England and France. Then nearly half a century later, the Turkish method is not credited to the Muslims, but to Dr. Edward Jenner although according to the obvious historical facts, that is untrue. Vaccination are the front line against all diseases and viruses, and in this lockdown hopefully we will find a vaccine soon. I hope this video has helped you understand the historical importance of vaccines and its true origins. Check out my previous videos to find out more about Muslim inventions and like, share, subscribe.